Hey you guys, it's Blue Nuts here. Um, I don't have a rant or a thought of the day. I have kind of like a, a weird problem. It's kind of weird. Um, anyways. La 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 la, la la. Oh, oh, oh. La 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 la, la la. Okay, so here is the problem that I'm talking about. Um, I love nature, I love outside, things like that. Um, and, uh, you know, I got my little, I have a little man-made stream that I built a while ago, a long while ago. We've been here for a minute. Um, don't plan on moving anywhere. I love where I live. Um, there were, at one point, I had two little ponds and then a stream. Well, the water got kind of hectic. We got new, neighbor, new neighbors that had kids and snakes really like the water, which, eh, there was one big, big, you know, uh, I forgot what you call the snakes, the black snake that kills all the cotton mouse and all that, which I'm not worried about those, but he was really big and he was in my pond, my little bitty pond, and the neighbors, the new neighbors that we have had kid, have kids, and I was like, okay, I'm not trying to lure any snakes over. I mean, they're going to be here, but I'm not trying to lure, so he was like living in it. So what I did is I um, filled both the two little ponds just with, you know, rock you know, or whatever, uh, just so it could stop that. But I did keep my stream because I built that stream and it's not the best looking stream in the world. There are things I still need to do to it, but I built it and I'm not taking it down. And I love the, the list, the flow of water. So anyway, the deal is with the stream is I went out there like, I don't know, two or three weeks ago and I was like, oh, okay, I got honeybees, which was great. I'm like, oh my God, I love that I can actually see honeybees. I mean people aren't seeing them a lot like you know we, you know just a lot you know there's a deal about honeybees dying off or people killing them and you know whatever but um so in the video that I'm about to show you you know like I said I know this and you, you'll be able to see in the video that I have a you know pretty a pretty decent amount of honeybees over there collecting water and I've never seen that before so check it out it's pretty it's, it's really neat and kind of interesting Okay, those are the ponds that I filled up with rocks. And now I'm about to zoom in and let you see the bees. You see some flying around. Today it's not quite a bit, but it's still like a few of them. It's just so weird. I mean, I know they're naturally collecting water or whatever, but I just never had, had this issue. Hopefully it's not a bad issue. Hopefully they're just getting water and moving along. But they, like I said, they've been here for a while. So assuming that the nest or hive or whatever is somewhere close, I'm sure. Because this is, I'm sure this is, my little stream is not the only stream out here. There's a water source, maybe a quote unquote running water source. And maybe that's what they tend to go to. But I, I read a little bit and they said something about they, they'll even drink mud water, you know, so of course there's some of that out here because it's been raining here a lot lately, off and on. But that is my, those are my bees. And I don't know. What do you guys think? Which, of course, I've seen an abundance of wasps, too, this year. Wasps and hornets and it's everywhere. But, of course, the honeybees aren't going to bother you. So. But it's kind of neat. kind of entertaining to watch them, you know. So, there they are. It's not like a big swarm or anything, but they're there. Me and my bees. Me and my little bees. You see what I'm talking about? You see all those bees? I mean, the honeybees or whatever. Um, what do you guys think? I believe they're honeybees. I mean, they look like honeybees. Um, I haven't seen a hive and they're not flying 
when they fly away, when they get really little, so, but I know that they're flying away from my house. They're not flying to the house. I don't have a honey hive or anything on my house or anything. I'm thinking somebody in the neighborhood has probably bought the honey, I mean, whatever, the hives, or the stackers or whatever you call them, and are probably getting, um, making honey, I mean, with these bees or whatever, but I don't know, it's neat. I'm not gonna let it get out of hand, though. I'll just call somebody that I need to come vacuum them up or whatever. No, I don't want them dead or anything, and I do love them over here because I have a couple of flowers and I want them to keep pollinating and all that, but, um, so, you see what I'm talking about? It's just, it's kind of, like I said, it's kind of neat, it's interesting. They don't bother you, you can get really close. I haven't aggravated them, so I haven't been stung by them. But, um, anyways, I thought that would, uh, would be kind of neat to share. And if anybody knows anything, hey, let me know, you know? I mean, I would like to hear some comments about, you know, is this just temporary or, you know, should I, do I need to get somebody out here to get rid of them or whatever? I mean, like I said, I really don't want to because they're not really bothering me. They're just collecting water and going on. So, anyways, that's it for the day. And uh, you know what I do. I post up like a bag of mixed flow nuts. See you next time.